What's up guys and welcome back to my channel. First and foremost, before I get started on this Sephora haul, I'm gonna leave a timestamp right here so you can fast forward to the haul and you can skip this part. But firstly, I wanna say I'm so sorry I haven't posted in the last week. I got really sick and for the life of me, I kind of lost my voice. My eyes became super dry and there are kind of flaky still, at least my eyelids are. And I just felt really weak and I just needed to take a week off and just rest and get my health back up. But now that I'm feeling a little bit better, I wanted to come on here, start off by showing you guys what I got in my Sephora V, uh, with Sephora Rouge. Sale. If you guys don't know, Sephora always has this sale two times a year and it's usually for Sephora members. It's completely free. You can sign up and you just gather points. If you guys haven't done this yet, I suggest you do because later on you can use those points towards your purchase. You can get $10 off or you can keep collecting them and collecting them until you feel like you want to redeem them. There are three levels. I'll go over them with you. There is the first one, which is Insider, which began uh, the 5th of November and it ends at the ninth and it's 10 percent off each time you go shopping at sephora and there's vib which is 15 percent off which started the third of november and it ends at the ninth of november and there's rouge there's 20 percent off from october 30th till the 9th of november I honestly had to take advantage of the sale and get stuff that I really wanted, especially with the 20% off and you keep using it as much as you can until that date. So let's get started. Of course, I already opened this box just to make sure nothing came in broken and I did look at some stuff, but I didn't swatch or anything just to make sure that it's not broken or melted. Cause last time I got lipsticks and they're melted. And in that one that that happened again. First off I see, I did stock up on my precisely my brow pencil. I did talk about this in one of my videos. I can't remember which one, but I had used this a bunch of times and I love this stuff. But ever since I found my NYX Micro Brow Pencil, I just completely forgot about this and just didn't restock. And since I did have 20, I thought might as well just restock on this. And this is in a shade for warm, deep brown. Ooh, okay, so let's see. I did get some Charlotte Tilbury lipsticks, which I don't own any Charlotte Tilbury, uh, Tilbury? Tilbury, you guys know what I'm talking about. I don't own any of her lipsticks or products, so I had to get some of her lip products. So I got four lipsticks, I'm so excited. Let's open them up. So I got the shade Very Victoria. I love the packaging, so beautiful. And I thought this was such a beautiful color. I believe I don't have a shade like this. So that's why I got it. It looks like this. It's so pretty. I can't wait to use it. And just her packaging is so luxe. And then I also got Wedding Bells just because I saw this shade and it looks so pretty online. I didn't get it. Of course, same packaging. Oh, they smell like vanilla too. This is it. It kind of looks like the one in the bottom, but this one's more pinkier. Can't wait to use those. I feel like I needed to up my lipstick game just because I feel like I use the same lipstick all the time and I had to change it up a bit at least. And this is in the shade Scarlet Spell. It's pretty. And 
next one is Pillow Talk. I believe this is her famous one that everyone buys. I'm not sure. But, of course, same packaging. I'll put it under this one. It's like a pinky nude. So pretty. This is Pillow Talk. I also got the lip liner to go with that lipstick. This is also Pillow Talk. If I can find the name to open it. When I got this package, I was so excited, but since I was so sick, like I couldn't get as excited. Which sucked. So this is Pillow Talk. Let's watch it under that lipstick. Yeah, they're exactly the same. You guys can tell. I love matching my lipsticks, my lip liners to my lipsticks. I don't know what it is. Next up, I did get the Makeup Forever Matte Velvet Skin 24 Hour High Coverage Multi Use Concealer. And I did get this in the shade 22, sorry, 2.2. And I got this because, as you guys know, I always use my Too Faced Born Sway Concealer and I just need to try something new. And I thought, why not try this one? Ooh, that looks super light. We'll see. I can probably turn that down. I'm excited to use it. Next up, I did get the Makeup by Mario Pro Lip Palette. I'm so excited about this. Like I said in the beginning of the video, I do want to up my lip game, so I thought this would be a good investment. And plus with the 20%, why not? So this is it. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. I love this. So this is the palette that comes with the lip brush as well, which I didn't know it came with. Probably wasn't paying attention. Oh, I think you can use this side of the lip uh, brush to scoop out some product and put it in your little mixy pan right here. I love that. Uh, I honestly thought that the little pan sizes would be bigger, but it's okay. That doesn't hurt anyone. Oh, I can't wait to use this. This is beautiful. Oh, forgot to put it in. That's awesome. And I believe this just also has like number names, no shade names. It's just like LP1, LP2, and that's awesome. I'm excited to use that. Ooh, I also did get one of his quads. I did get Party Glam, perfect for this time of season, for the holidays, and it has a blue in here I fell in love with and I need to try out. This is how it looks like. And these are the shades. This gives me New Year's Eve vibes. Like I need to use this for a holiday tutorial. Either way, this is absolutely gorgeous. Look at that blue. That's amazing. Can't we tease it? And then another thing I splurged on was the Bejeweled Eyes to Hypnotize palette by Charlotte Tilbury. Like I've said before, I don't own anything Charlotte Tilbury and I had to take advantage of the sale and I saw this palette and I thought, how gorgeous would it be to have this in my collection? The very first one too, I'm so excited. Ooh. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. Look at these shades, you guys. Sorry you can see my camera and my light in the background, but. <sighs> these are beautiful. Should I use this? Well, obviously I'm gonna use this in a tutorial and see if it's worth your monies. 
That's awesome. And it comes like in little quads. I like that. This is so luxe. And also I had to get the Naughty palette from Huda Beauty. This is her new palette that she came out with. And I'm so stoked about this one as well. So this is the palette. Look how gorgeous those shades are. This is a nude palette that she came out with. Ooh. I know she came out with like a gloss shade, which is this one right here, which is called Slippery. I'm also gonna use this in a tutorial, you guys. Don't worry and see if you guys should get it or not. But this is, has to be like the sister to the new nude palette that she has. This is awesome. I can't wait. She has like this beautiful marbling in her palettes. Oh. Wow. And I also did get three other products that should be coming in anytime soon. But um, obviously I couldn't wait to open up this stuff first. So I had to, you know, show you guys these, these products first. But I will insert purchase of the stuff that I did get. It's nothing too crazy. The only thing I did splurge on was a Makeup Forever um, foundation stick palette which has like several shades in it to use on other people, which I have been doing. And I also got the Dior highlighter, which everyone raves about. And I said, I never spend money like this and I probably shouldn't, but I just had to. It was gorgeous. It's like the highlighter palette. And then I got just a replacement of my Beauty Blender Solid cleanser that I used to wash my brushes and I Got that and that's about it. I'm so sorry I missed a week full of tutorials. I promise I'll make it up to you guys and I can't wait to use all these products in my next videos. So if you guys enjoyed this VIB, VIB sale and you guys wanna see more of these videos and every year when they come out with um, these sales, let me know, give me a thumbs up, comment below what you guys got in your um, sale, and also let me know where you guys' favorite products are, or products you've been dying to try, because I'm always looking out for those new products that come out. And again, I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and don't forget to like this video, comment below, hit that subscribe button before you leave, and I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Bye guys, have a good one.